Hey friends, it's John Asraf and I hope you're having an amazing day. Now many people ask me, why is it that I do what I do? And what I can share with you is here's one of my main reasons. I just returned from a trip to New Zealand and Australia and while I was at the back of the event room that I was in, I met a woman. Her name was Christy Charlton and she gave me this card. Now, I didn't read it when she gave it to me. I just read it yesterday when I got home and I unpacked. And let me share with you a little bit about what she wrote in the card to help you understand why I do what I do. It says, Dear Mr. Asaraf, thank you for being a very special person, which is very nice of her, who has changed my life so much. I can now give my son and myself the life we've dreamed of. Though your programs, you know, I started two years ago, the exercises that I did within the programs helped me reach my goals that were so precise, I hit every one of them just one day before the two-year goal and the declaration that I made when I wrote my goals out in one of your programs. Thank you so much. Now, why am I sharing this with you? Well, as somebody who travels all over the world, speaking to hundreds of thousands of people a year, I get to witness some just amazing results from individuals, people who suffer from a variety of different challenges, life circumstances, and things that have happened to people that just really set their life off course. And I get to see people coming from the brink of hell in some cases back to a life where they're achieving extraordinary success. I see people whose life's difficulties really put them in a place where it seems impossible for them to get out of those challenges and achieve the results they want. And what I love more than anything else is to be part of their transformation. And I'd love to be a part of yours. It's what really gives my life so much purpose and meaning, just like the people that gave me their time, their knowledge, their strategies and skills that helped me get myself out of getting into so much trouble when I was a teen, to living a life now that I'm proud of and that I get to do what I do. Now, my way of giving back is to do what my mentors did for me. And something that I've done for the last several years is an event called the Brainathon, which is all about helping individuals shatter their financial glass ceiling. And the reason I focus some of my attention on financial aspects is because money gives people the ability to have discretionary time to take better care of their health, their family, the charities they believe in, to do the things that they really want to do with their lives that give their life more purpose and meaning. Now, since last year's Brainathon, some of the transformations that I've seen include a woman from Perth, Australia, who uh, was in her 60s and was earning about $12,000 a year, and she had one goal. Her goal was to take her grandchildren to Disneyland. And on $12,000 a year, being a caregiver, she really couldn't do it. But by applying what she learned in the Brainathon and retraining her brain, she made over $75,000 in the last 12 months. Now, that may not sound like a lot of money to you, but for somebody who's making $12,000 to go to $75,000 and being able to take her grandchildren to Disneyland, that's a huge accomplishment. See, it wasn't the money she wanted, it was what she could do with the money that she wanted. Another amazing transformation that I know of is one of our students who is an MBA graduate, you know, who went to school to, to learn business, who happened to be totally broke and suffering from a traumatic divorce, and now turned her message you know, into one that helps thousands of people around the year and she's now making hundreds of thousands of dollars a year as a speaker and author. Another great story was of a homeless man who was living, you know, in, in a dirty old home basically that didn't have doors and windows. And he took what he learned 
and now owns over 200 properties that are worth over $10 million. And now he's able to give to other people by teaching them what he does and making a difference in their lives. And the list goes on and on. And what caused these massive shifts in their lives, it wasn't how smart they were because they were just as smart before. It wasn't how much they knew or didn't know. What changed was they all learned how to release the self-doubts, the insecurities, the embarrassment, the shame, the, the fears of success or fear of failure, the fear of disappointing others if they didn't succeed. And they all learned how to gain the confidence and the certainty that they needed to succeed versus the lack of confidence and lack of certainty that was crippling their financial and life success. Now, on this year's Brainathon, I've got some amazing new students who you're gonna meet who were on last year's Brainathon, took action, retrained their brain over the last year, and are now experiencing amazing life success, health success, financial success, and they're gonna share with you, you know, their situation before and what's happened in the last 12 months and specifically what they did to now be able to live an amazing life where they're happy, they're healthy, they're free, and more importantly, they feel like their life has purpose and meaning. You're gonna hear from individuals like Frederick Entenmann, who was a former professional basketball player in Europe, who got out of deep credit card debt and moved from basically a ghetto dump apartment uh, that was I think 850 square feet to an absolutely beautiful dream home with him and his partner Kim and their kids that he was able to bring together. He bought a new car, started a new business, and now he's earning what he's really worth. You'll also meet a great gal, Zena Solomon, who comes from a human resource background, making you know, $50,000, $60,000 a year and sabotaging her success through her thoughts and her behaviors. And what I know is she had a goal of being financially free of being confident, of being certain, and she wanted to make over $100,000 a year. Guess what? This year is the first year she's surpassing $100,000 a year. You'll also meet a guy, Jonathan Henrich, who is a former drummer, and he had, unfortunately, a massive brain tumor. And not only did he fully recover, but he recovered financially and transformed his life around and what I'd love to share with you more than, than anything is that you can have a transformation, but you have to be willing to at least show up, learn and apply what we will teach you. Not only from the people that are doing it, but I've got six amazing mindset experts, people who are renowned in their fields, in psychology, in brain research, in, 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 in uh, neuropsychology. And what they're gonna teach you is how to Create a transformation in your life, whether it's your finances, your health, your life, regardless of where you are right now. A dear friend of mine has agreed to be on the call and to teach you. His name is Dr. Srinivasan Pile, who's assistant clinical professor of psychiatry at Harvard Medical School. He is one of the best in the world understanding the brain, images of the brain, stress, fear, anxiety. And he's gonna help you really understand, number one, that that all is normal, but also how do you overcome some of the deepest, innermost fears that you have of success, of failure, of, of not looking good enough. And he's gonna really show you how to get unstuck from anything that is unconsciously or even that you're aware of that's holding you hostage and keeping you stuck at your current level of success. We have Dr. Serrano, or Sarno, excuse me, who is a licensed psycho psychologist and she went through an amazingly traumatic experience where she was basically sold as a slave and she had to overcome her family selling her as a slave when she was younger. And now she not only lives an abundant, amazing life herself, but she works with patients from all over the world to help them overcome any of their traumas and past circumstances or events that are holding them back. Now, regardless of what your situation is, I'm sure there are things that are in your way, whether it's you not feeling smart enough or good enough, or you've had traumatic experiences in your life like failures. What we have on this Brainathon are the best of the best, including mindset expert and best-selling author, 
doctor, or not doctor, but a neuroscientist, Mark Waldman, who's an adjunct professor at Loyola Marymount University. And he is gonna specifically show you how do you take your negative thoughts, your negative emotions, past experiences, and any of the crazy disempowering effects that these thoughts and emotions have on your behavior. And he'll teach you how to release these subconscious blockages based on cutting edge science and methodologies that are like bleeding edge. This past week, he is on the cutting edge of what's happening right now. And the reason we're doing this is because this is what is necessary for you to let go, release any of the blockages that are holding you back. And more importantly, to give you that clear lane to be able to achieve what you want to achieve. I also arranged for Ruth Bozinski, who's a licensed psychologist, and she's the president and founder of the National Institute for Clinical Application of Behavioral Medicine. What does that mean? Well, she takes the latest research and helps people apply the clinical application of that to help them get rid of their excuses, their stories, their traumas. And so you're gonna learn how to maximize your brain's powerful ability to number one, accept what's happened to you in the past because that is one of the first steps. And to be able to release the negative emotions and thoughts and behaviors that our unconscious mind is consistently running in the background using the attention units that are so needed for you to achieve your success instead of using it to hinder your success. I also have a great friend of mine, Jim Bunch, who's an expert coach on accountability and setting up your outside environment and your internal environment for you to be able to achieve your absolute best now, all the latest research talks about something called epigenetics. And epigenetics is simply that you're not a victim of your genetic makeup or even your conditioning anymore. Your outside environment and your internal environment of your thoughts, your emotions, and your, and your uh, feelings around those really dictate you know, how you perform. So Jim will be able to teach you how to set up your outside environments to achieve the highest levels of success. Now, I'm going to be your host through this entire seven hour brainathon. And what I love to specialize in is something that I've worked on for 35 years. How do I reset my own financial thermostat and my financial blueprint? And I'm going to teach you how you can reset your financial thermostat and blueprint just as easily as you can reset the temperature in a room by going to the thermostat and making some adjustments. I'll help you release the unconscious blockages that are holding you back so that you can release them, feel confident, feel certain, and get your brain, your emotions, and your body aligned with what you need to do so you can double or triple your income in the next six to 12 months so that you can start living the life of your dreams, making a bigger difference in the lives of others, and feeling like your life has so much purpose and meaning. This is what gives me the most amount of joy. I love to assemble the best people in the world, not just for myself, but for my friends and my clients. And so be sure to click the opt-in on this page, commit to attend, and here's what I can share with you. If you don't, then you're gonna keep running the same thoughts, the same emotions, and the same behaviors. You'll continue to hold on to your stories, your excuses, your fears, your paradigms, and those are all the things that are keeping you stuck and comfortable in your zone. Now, our brain is wired to keep us comfortable. Even if you're miserable, you could be comfortable. Even if you're broke, you can be comfortable. What we need to do is show you how to get out of your comfort zone and learn how to get comfortable with adaptability and change just long enough to reset your financial, health, and life thermostat so you start to achieve everything you're capable of achieving and living the life you are meant to live. So make sure that you opt in now, tell your friends, bring your family on. It's seven hours of unbelievable content, stories from people that are doing it right now, and you will learn not just through their stories, but through experts, how you can transform your life and make your results predictable. 
So all the information is on the other side of the button that you just need to click with all the speakers and their bios. So sign up now and do me a favor, share it with your friends so we really help transform the world together.